here's a quick tutorial for you guys. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and log in here. And we're going to edit an existing article. You had mentioned uh, this weddings article. I'm going to replace the image at the bottom. And you should see this editor come up. If not in the user manager, you can set your preferences for what editor shows up there. I use the JCE editor. So go ahead and click this image. And we're going to scroll back up here to the editor buttons here at the top. And you wanted Vicky and Ernie in there, which I downloaded from the Dropbox and uh, resize those accordingly uh, to be optimized for the web. Some of them were pretty big, um, but let's see, we want to, so I set up a folder in here. Um, I thought I did. Um, oh, that was for the slideshows. I'm going to go ahead and make a new folder in this main root folder, and uh, we're just going to call it new images. You won't have to do this every time, but for to keep things organized, we can just put them in this new images. It'll show up at the bottom here. And once you're in there, you go ahead and click this upload button. We're going to browse. I'm going to come to Sleepy Hollow. I have them saved in this new images folder. And we're going to put this one in. And you click the upload, and you'll see that show up here. You can see the dimensions, 650 by 433, and you can see the dimensions here. It's a little over 400. Uh, but we're, what we're going to do is link this image to pop up in a nice window. So go ahead and click this file here. You'll see the new image show up here. I'm just going to bump this back down to... 400 then click here make sure the proportions checked and when you click in here that value will update and we're going to leave everything else the same scroll down click update actually while we're here go ahead and grab this link copy it then click update and click this in uh go back to the bottom and click the image you just put in. So here's Vicky and Ernie. And you want to click this insert edit link button. And you want to replace this URL with the new one. I just pasted that in there. And in the future, if you need to add an image you want to pop up in a light box, you come to this pop-ups and choose JCE. And you can give it a caption, etc. So I'm going to click Update here. I'm going to click Save. I'm going to come to the front end. I'm going to click on the menu for Weddings. And we can scroll down the page here. And here's our new image. And that'll pop up in a nice full size. Full size is 650 across. That's what I've been making all the images at 72 DPI. So I'm telling you guys this stuff in case you need to do it at some point in the future. Or you can just have me keep doing it. Um, so that's pretty much how the replace image and the link for the pop-up. So once you like everything here, go ahead and click save and close. And voila. Um, call me if you have any questions about this tutorial.